I started as a young guy with my uh, my father and my grandfather. That's how it all began when I was a child. And uh, when I get older, I I find my place on the sea. After high school, I chose to go to the sea and be a fisherman. You have to be a little bit tough to be a fisherman, for sure. On the sea, you can go wherever you want to, nearly. Of course, it's a rough job, but uh, but uh, it is it is still nice to not only to, to spend the time on the sea, also come home and, and enjoy life. I think it's a very fulfilling job, yes. In the good old days in fishing, it was all done by hook and crook and filleting the fish on the boat with whatever comes from that in cold water, like cuts, frozen hands, which should lead to terrible looking hands, which surprisingly they didn't have, which begs the question that came from the University of Iceland, why, why not, what's going on? They then started a research program to look at the different parts of the cod to figure out what, what's going on with, them, with the interaction with the cod and they realized that when the, one of the things they cut out of the cod is a viscera and they throw it overboard. So they started doing some studies on the viscera and realized it was full of an enzyme called trypsin. These enzymes were Atlantic cod trypsins, uh, which were found to be very active. Uh, for example, at temperatures found on human skin and on mucous membranes. And the special catalytic effect of the acotrypsins called for development. And this process led to the creation of a unique formulation called Pensine, which among other things contains glycerol and also our globally patented um, cotrypsins. Common cold is, is the most common type of upper respiratory um, infection or the, the most common type of upper respiratory illness. And yeah, I mean, there's not really a, a cure for, for the common cold um, and most people will just treat the, the symptoms um, whilst it sort of naturally passes and, and they get rid of it. They, it's not something that there's any sort of real protection from for most people, a common cold it can affect their, you know, well-being, quality of life, um, and, and stuff like that. So there are wider implications for for people suffering with these. Penzyme is a unique formulation, which is the end product of a optimally isolating, purifying, and stabilizing this unique enzyme in a formulation that can be used in products in upper respiratory infections. It's really important to treat upper respiratory uh, infections uh, pretty early. They mutate a lot and therefore vaccination might be less effective. So we look at the viral load in these cultures, then we look at inflammatory reactions by various methods. And uh, third, we also look at tissue destruction because the viruses destroy the tissues, they make holes into the tissues, and this is what you immediately see also in the microscope. The development of Pensheim, there were further studies conducted and the studies quickly showed that pensum formulations were effective against viruses. When sprayed, the product forms an immediate physical barrier. The barrier captures viruses and disables their ability to infect cells and multiply. Our product actually stops the viruses sticking, breaks the virus cycle, and therefore lowers the viral load in the body dramatically, and then lets the body heal itself. 
It's only when the body gets overloaded with viruses it can't cope and we get sick. The first study I did was investigating a group of endurance athletes and what I found with that research was the group that used the product had a significantly lower symptom ratings and also the duration that they suffered with those symptoms was significantly lower. When we applied the product uh, prior to infection we then saw really a significant decrease of the viral load and we also saw that the tissue integrity was completely rescued, giving us promising results that the uh, product is really nicely working against the virus. It's quite unique to have a product that is not you know, having an effect only on the symptoms. So you are affecting the root cause of the infection rather than just the symptoms which then can uh, either shorten the duration of an infection or prevent an infection. It's very rare that you have a product that has the consumer satisfaction that they have. We'll just keep continuing what we're already doing. We're just on the start of the journey and show that the product truly works in terms of breaking the virus cycle. So we'll find out what the product actually works against and then keep pushing for the broader opportunity we are convinced that at a point in time, bigger opportunity will come from bigger players approaching us in terms of fast tracking, more solutions against upper respiratory tract infections. That the product will have uh, multiple applications against other viruses, other infections, and that's the way we look at the business moving forward.